Okay, hello guys, and welcome to the last part of my tutorial series uh, how to, of how to create a walking animation in Flash. So, um, right now what we're gonna do is um, we're going to finish with the legs to make them look right, and then we're gonna um, uh, do the arms. Okay, so let's start out by finishing the legs. So I just noticed that there was something wrong with this last frame. So in this frame, this leg should be behind the other leg. So I'm just gonna fix that really quick. It's like one last thing that we need to do to finish this, okay. So yeah, I'm just gonna make this leg be like behind the other leg. And um, 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 let's see here. You know what? I'm just gonna block everything except for dead legs, so I don't know. It's better. And, um, let's see how this looks. That's a lot better, see guys. This is a lot better. I'm just gonna put this down and turn. Okay. Okay guys, so now that we're done with the legs, we're just gonna finish by doing the arms. The arms are like the easiest thing to do, believe me. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and lock everything except for the right arm. The right arm we're gonna go all the way back to frame one, and then we're gonna select the right arm, and then um, we're gonna bend the arm a little bit, just a little bit, not too much, just like so, and then we're gonna move, all, rotate all the arm, and then we're gonna block everything except for the right arm, and uh, you know what? We're just gonna we're gonna um, you press the show all the layer outlines except for this one and um same thing we're just gonna bend it and but the only difference is instead of um moving it back we're gonna move it like to the front like this ah oh, sorry i selected the leg okay like so okay now um, i'm just gonna move this a little uh, just a little more to the back back sorry to back okay um okay that, that's better okay so now um we're gonna add a keyframe on the last frame same with the other arm oh arm sorry not leg oh, yeah, this is the arm I <laughs> stay with me okay um yeah, so for both arms. And then we're gonna add a keyframe on frame 25. And same for the right arm. And this keyframe, when we're gonna make the opposite, we're gonna move the right arm to the front like this, and then the left arm to the back. I'm just gonna lock everything except for the left arm, not leg. You know what guys, this is confusing. I'm just gonna change the name of the arm to left arm. There we go. So now, same, just move it to the back like this. There we go guys. So, um, let's see how this looks. We forgot to add the classic between, always, oh, never forget to do that. Without a classic between, everything would look so crappy. <laughs> I can't even imagine. Be horrible. Okay, there we go. So I think let's see here. I think we're probably gonna be done for now. Um we're just gonna move this more to the front and the other thing more to the back because it's sort of like too slow. Like 
and then this bar over here. Classic tool again. Oops. There we go. Um. Oh yeah, I created this in frame 25, this, is, yeah, no, 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 forget it, forget it, guys, I'm just confusing you. We're gonna need to fix some parts of the leg. Better. Okay, so let's see here. What we're gonna do now is we're gonna wait. Oh, th there's something wrong with this. We need to move this leg. This other leg. I'm gonna this right leg so I don't get confused. Okay, so we need to move this like over here. What? Uh, see, oh, yeah, yeah. What the heck? Sorry about that, guys. Okay, so um, the left arm, I'm gonna hide everything for the same here. Oh no, look, everything. There we go. So, um, the left arm, I'm just gonna rotate it a little more. Like so. Let's see how this looks, guys. Yeah, so this is looking pretty good, guys. Um, now let's try doing something real quick. So, okay, let's see here. Now we're just gonna um, convert this into a symbol. The we're gonna convert the symbol into another symbol. It's gonna be called. Character one walking one, and um, we're gonna have fifty frames as before, and then let's see here we're gonna add a frame on frame ten, same as always, thirty, forty, and fifty. Ah, oh, sorry, forty and fifty, and on frame ten. We're gonna move this up 10 or 5 times. By the way, I'm doing this with the up arrow on the keyboard. I'm doing 40 also. And yeah, this should look pretty good. Mm. Okay. So now it looks like it was working. See? 
And um, now the last thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna um, uh, create the walking cycle from here to there. Um, okay, so this is a classic. Tw we're gonna create a classic tune. We're gonna move this to to the other part of the of the um, this thing. Okay, there we go. So see, now we have the walking animation. It, this looks pretty cool, guys. So we're done with it. And see, this actually looks of it as if someone was walking, like I told you. So yeah, guys, thank you for watching, and we're finally done with it. Uh, hope you hope you like hope you guys learned something from this, and we'll um, see you guys later in another tutorial. Uh, thank you for watching, guys. Maybe we're gonna make another tutorial when where we're gonna add, like a background or a little more shadows. There's probably gonna be one more tutorial that is just gonna last like not that much. So yeah, guys, we'll see you then. Bye.